Welcome or welcome back to Life with Linda Muri, where we do everything home. In case this is your first time here, hello, welcome to this channel and feel free to subscribe guys. So today we are going to do some grocery shopping and I have a challenge to these guys. I want to see what 10,000 Kenyan shillings will be able to get me for my groceries. And guys, for these groceries, you will not be seeing cereals because for my cereals, I prefer to buy them in a local market where it's way way cheaper and also things to do with like oils body perfumes and shops i normally shop those from a wholesale shop guys so those things you'll not be able to see them here but for the rest of the stuff you will be able to see them here let's see what 10,000 kenyan shillings can be able to get us 10,000 is around actually a hundred dollars so let's see what a hundred dollars will be able to get us for groceries for the whole of this month guys so stay tuned and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already share my content out and i would really appreciate guys so let's get straight to shopping your first time on this channel on this channel we do a lot of cleaning and of course when it comes to shopping for cleaning products i always take around 30 minutes on the cleaning products aisle just to see what's new and what's not guys so today guys and remember we are shopping in kafo i love kafo because in kafo we have quite a variety of cleaning products and you know guys taking your sweet time here is a must guys so let me know down in the comment section guys which cleaning products do you like never miss in your trolley when you go for your monthly grocery shopping let me know because as for me i always always shop for a surface cleaner or a kitchen cleaner every end month this is a no-brainer because you know we want our countertops clean we want our surfaces disinfected so always a cleaning product will be in my Surely all the time let me know what's yours so guys the good thing with coming to the supermarket at this time the supermarket is empty there's no one in here like we are like maybe 10 or 20 people like there are no people here and i have these gloves those are poor quality so they are not taking those but the supermarket is empty guys Something else I forgot to mention guys, what you not be seeing here is ugali flour because since the economy is so high in Kenya right now, what I do, I get my maize from home and then I just go to the posho mill and get, you know, flour. You go grind your maize and get flour. So that's what I do. I no longer buy flour from the supermarket. This is ugali flour. Things that I buy in the supermarket is just all purpose flour or baking flour in general guys. And guys... There were these very cute plates and cups in this supermarket that 
I really wanted to pick, but because I'm on a budget, and you know what, Just World has taught us to be conscious of our shopping and our budget, so we never go out of our budget nowadays. We are sticking to the shopping list thanks to Just World channel. If you are not watching her, guys, I will link her channel in the description box below so that she can be able to help you with your finances and also with budgeting, guys. Be sure to check her out and I would really appreciate it. We are back home and I have laid, like, placed my things here. I just want to take you through real quick uh, what we bought for grocery this month of August because the month is just starting, you know, we have to stock up on things. So, but now, guys, something to note nowadays, I usually shop according to my need. When something runs out, I go and shop. So, let's start with the toiletry washing here. soap. Whenever I'm shopping at Carrefour, I have to get this because I really, really love this. It lathers so well. So I got that. And on top of that, I added this AZ or AZ. I don't know how it's pronounced. AZ washing paste. This was on offer. I got um, Safi regular bleach. Then I got um, this disinfectant. Mr. Muscle was not there. I don't know. I don't think... Um, Carrefour does stock this. It was not there. So I picked this disinfectant. And then for the toilet, I I picked this for the guest uh, toilet because we have run out of this. But for my toilet, we still have that. So no need of buying two. And for this month, guys, I'm introducing, um, what is this? Is it called? Astonish cleaning products in my cleaning, um, you know. If you have not watched my cleaning, like uh, my pr cleaning products review, go watch it to see which other products I normally use in my cleaning. I have a whole video on my on cleaning products, guys. So I did pick this up. This is a multi-purpose that has bleach, perfect for my countertops, for my surfaces to clean. So I'm trying out because Rays of Sly or Sly of Rays of Sly channel has been telling me to get onto this stuff but i've been like you know mm, but now i have guys i have felt the pressure and now here we are so i bought that and i also added this one this is for the carpet i really wanted for the carpet because the cleaner that i use for my carpet it's over so i was like you know today i have to stock up on this and i decided to try out astonish just that astonish are quite pricey but you know um, what I'm going to do or what I usually do every month I go shopping I have to like buy two cleaning products so this month I'm introducing this so this is for the carpet and upholstery so I guess you can also use it on your couch as well so those are the two new products for this month's haul and then I bought that aqua fresh because it was on sale yeah, guys i picked these uh, what are they called air max for the two toilets that are in this house i also added this for the um, guest bathroom or is it guest toilet let's just call it toilet yeah i think okay and then my son still uses diapers at night <laughs> because we are not over that sometimes you know he messes up sometimes he doesn't mess up so usually i'll just pick these for those nights that you know you don't want to wake up at night all the time so this is what we use here monthly that's why you see it's a small pack because 
he is not on diaper full time and then i got um this musafi washing powder i don't think i have tried this but this was what was on offer and right now we are buying everything that is on offer so i picked that and i think that's for the oh, for the toilet or something else i picked up some pads two of these i normally use cortex or mall pad but you know today i picked that so i think that's it for the toiletry so let's go to the food stuffs let me just place you there because my hand is already tired of holding the camera so something else i picked up is this um tenor kitchen roll together with this rosy what's this called rosy serviettes yeah rosy serviettes something else i picked up is this uh, toilet paper these are tissues and i know these ones they are a pack of uh, how many a pack of 10 and these were the cheapest this is toilets a pack of this was going i don't remember the price so let me not lie so like a pack of this 10 i know it will take us for the whole month because in this house there are not so many they're just two adults and one child yeah so let's get to the food stuff i picked up these noodles i have never bought these ones i normally buy the indomie ones but the same round i thought let me pick this so I picked these ones for them because Zen loves Indomie. I picked these ones up. Mommy. Yes? You want water? You want water or you want juice? Mm. Yeah. Guys, just a minute, motherhood beauties. Uh, go sit down. Don't press it. Don't press it. Uh, go sit down. Oh guys, sorry about that. Yeah, so I see that I had picked those uh, ones. And then I had run out of all purpose flour, so I did pick up two. But for the self freezing, I still have like two kgs in here. So I only picked these two for all purpose. And I know this will push us until the month ends. If we run out of this, we we'll just, you know go and buy more but this is what oh this one is even broken i need to transfer this so i bought those two guys this is um x and this is Adam. i don't have a preference when it comes to this so my friends say this is the best the adab filler yeah and then i picked up this sugar these are 2 kg sugar i think even in my like last video I had picked up, I had already bought like 2 kgs of sugar, so we still have sugar, so this was just a top up of that. And then I picked up some tomato paste, because in this house we don't use a lot of tomatoes, I'm always alternating between tomatoes and tomato paste. So I can use one tomato and then add some tomato paste, so I picked four of these, and then, then go sit down. Then I picked this spaghetti. This is called Milano from, you know, this is Kafo. I have never seen this in other supermarkets. So I picked this too. I'm hoping my fingers are crossed that they do not disappoint because they did not have any other, uh, any other, uh, they did not have Santa Maria or Santa Lucia spaghetti. So I picked this two up. And in this house, we don't do a lot of spaghetti. It's only my son is a fan of this. So, Moving on, I took these things. I bought these two. This is caramel tea and this is cinnamon tea. This is spice tea. So I picked these two up because I am a fan of tea. I am also a fan of coffee. So and this I love like uh, these are flavored teas. So I picked these two up. I feel like guys. By placing you over on that stand, you are not even seeing what I got. So that's the caramel tea, and this is the cinnamon tea. This is uh, the Milano spaghetti that I was talking about. And then I picked up that Highland juice because sometimes when you have visitors, you can just dilute this and give it to them, and it's way cheaper than the packed one. And then I got these for Zen. 
I got six of them as you have seen he has just already taken one <laughs> kids I took six of those for you know then sometimes when you are just in the house they want to snack on things and all that I also picked up these oats these are instant oats that you know for breakfast for both us and also Zen Zen is not a fan of this I'm trying like to you know get him to love oats but he's not a fan of oats so I guess this will be just mine and then I picked up this soy sauce guys this is a superior dark jade bridge I have never used this type of um, soy sauce so I'm hoping it doesn't disappoint I picked up Royco and guys as you can see I love buying things in sachets because it's way way is way way cheaper I mean so I picked up that and then for my coffee guys as I have I have just said now I love picking things in sachets because this way it's very very cheap so I picked like 20 of these there are here so many of them like you can see they are quite a lot so I picked like 20 pieces of that I picked up these Reco cubes. Uh, yeah, I picked up Reco cubes as well. And then I picked up this chili beef because I love the taste of this thing. And then I added some cocoa, guys. And I, as I said, I buy in sachets because it's way cheaper. It's way cheap, guys. So I bought four of these. So I know that one will last as for a while something else guys i picked up uh these um what are they called this one's witabix and guys i always always buy in sachets so so i bought this yeah like i bought like six pieces we can always like restock because i know these ones will not even last for long zen loves witabix so I only bought those six vanilla flavor and the original flavor for Weetabix. And then I also added this uh, mojito juice. I love this mojito, guys. It's like one of our favorites in this house. We love that. So we have this is um, multi fruit fruit drink. And what they even mean? Multi fruit. This is a mango fruit. I guess this is a mixture of you know all those fruits there. This is mango and then this is lemon. This is my favorite. So I picked those up. So let's move to you know other stuff. This guys are the noodles that I was talking about. This is a beef flavor. They are called noodles. Three minutes noodles. So this is the flavor that we picked up they just a pack of five the same way as uh, our indomie is so guys let's move on to you know this fridge or whatever what are they called i don't know uh, i picked up this coconut cream i always always love the packed ones like the ones in sachets like this because i can just use this one in one meal and that will be enough so i picked up four because they did not even have the ones in cans and then for milk i picked up this type of milk because it was the cheapest i picked up one two five milk then guys i picked up uh, these yogurts because i always find this uh, size to be perfect for you know for zen for school even just for home for snacks so i had picked up six but he has already already taken one then i picked up um maziwa lala maziwa lala i picked up four packs these are three another one is here so i picked up four of those and then something else i did pick up um for my you know like vegetable rice or just veggies or even when i'm making salads i picked up this sweet corn so you can see i picked up this sweet corn and guys it was very cheap i was surprised because sweet corn they always sell to us very expensive but in kafo this was 67 kenyan shillings for three pieces so i found that to be very affordable and then i picked up this blue band because it was on offer yeah guys i picked up this blue band because it was on offer it was coming with this 
tin and you know then can always use this for you know fruits and all that and then down there i picked um what is this called prestige margarine because of my baking i usually use this to bake i prefer this to the other one which which was the other one again to the normal butter because butter is quite expensive this is you know affordable so i normally bake with that and then i don't think i have like let's see. i don't think i had shared with you this these are macaroni you can call them pasta if you like so that's what i picked up again we don't eat like a lot of pasta in this house so this is just for zen yeah and for fruits guys let's go to fruits now for fruits i picked up these uh, grapes because i find that grapes in supermarkets it's very very cheap compared to our like local vendors so i picked up those and then i picked up these um apples i know this will be enough for zen because zen loves apples guys he can eat two three apples in a day so i picked how many pieces are these six these are seven pieces actually so this will be enough and then i picked up these ones i don't know what are these called are these the same with pixies or are these different they are not oranges so this is what i added we still need to go to the local market and get some other groceries because this is not everything so i also did pick some tomatoes and some onions on our way back so yeah i think guys that's everything that you know we picked up so what's remaining guys it's now for me to arrange all these and organize and arrange oh something else this i got is this i know this is a chopping board but i'm not going to use it as a chopping board i want to use it to just organize uh, some stuff here so i will show you guys that but i think i have shown you everything that we got so the only thing that let me turn around this camera so guys the only thing that we did not get as you have seen here is um what is it called for meats because we prefer to go and buy those in kenya meat commission so because there it's cheap and you know it's also uh you know it's a trustworthy place because it's from meat kenya meat commission because i used to buy in bama market but not anymore because we realized that meat there is not even um what is it called some of those like meat or some of those yeah meat that they sell they, they are not um, is it commission i don't know but they do not have like the kids um sticker or whatever that is so because one time we bought some beef there and it disappointed them time so the only thing i can buy from baba market is chicken but for beef i go to kenya meat commission so that's where we will be going to buy uh, meat. Again, have not seen here is uh, some sausages, some smokies, because those ones again we are going to buy them uh, from the manufacturers. I don't know what they are called, but they are located somewhere in Kasarani. We used to buy there a long time ago, but we have not like bought from there for a long time, and we found out that there it's actually cheaper compared to the supermarket. So there is where we'll go get uh, stuff like sausages and smokies and all that because. There is where they manufacture it's just the same way we are going to buy the meat commission but this one is called yeah farmer's choice yeah we'll go to buy to farmer's choice it's located in kasarani in case you are also want to go it's way 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 cheaper there compared to the local supermarket so we thought you know save a coin we will go get them there but guys this is everything that i was able to get so i'll just um go ahead arrange all these and um, I will see you in my next video. So guys, that's it from me today. Thank you so much for watching. I do hope that you did enjoy today's video. If you did, kindly give it a thumbs up. Share me out if you can and I would really appreciate. Until my next one, love and light. Bye-bye.